Uh, hello, Mark of the Irish Football Fan TV. I'm delighted to be joined by Derry City's Brandon Kavanagh. You're back in Dublin. Uh, you always seem to be turning out for these events. I'd say you're a big FIFA player first and foremost. We're here for the EA FC 24. I think that's how you say it. Um, you're obviously getting your copy and you must be getting a few free ones for doing this. Yeah, of course. Um, yeah, that was great to tour up to these sort of events, you know, and it's um, I'm really excited to get going, get playing the game. Talk to me about uh, FIFA, I suppose, over the years, because... I think, Forgive me, forgive me if I'm wrong. You were here last year promoting this. Was he? No, Brian. Brian Mar was here. Oh yes, he was. Sorry, but you were here for the cup final. Yeah, the cup final. So yeah. yeah. So yeah, I suppose it's been a, it's a decent, been a decent enough year for you. Win the cup final, runners up in the league, and um, there's still a bit of a run in now in the league. Obviously, a disappointing result the other night. But um, how are you kind of feeling coming up towards the end of this season now? And how would you assess, I suppose, the last year for yourself? Yeah, I think it's been brilliant, especially for the group. You know, um, going through two rounds of Europe. Um, Obviously, didn't do as well as we wanted in the cup. We want to be back here. Um, that was unfortunate, but like what you said, there's five games left, loads of points to play for, and yeah, we're going to try to bring it down to the final day. Yeah, I mean, it was a good little European run as well. So, like, I mean, in terms of the season itself, there's lots to build on there, but there's lots of positives, I think, from a dairy point of view. You've given the support, there's plenty of good nights out. Obviously, I mentioned the, the cup final here and winning that. Um, you know, you're no stranger to winning the cup either, are you? No, I've won it twice, like, but. Um, yeah, listen, it's uh, unfortunate we can't be here this year, but look what you're saying, the, the team's getting stronger, you know, it was, and the depth is getting it's getting better, so look, ne next year we can only look forward, you know, only, only look forward to it. Are you a bit fear fearful for your place then, considering the, the money that's up at Derry, and um, obviously you said there, you know, the depth in the squad and stuff like that, I mean, you've got some really top-level players, some of the best players in the country, in your squad yeah. now, if you can add to that. I really feel like you can maybe go one step further against Rovers next season. Yeah, no, listen, uh, like look back myself, you know, back myself to the hill. So for me, it's just about keep working hard and staying fit, and that's all that matters really. And when, when I'm called upon, whether I'm starting or coming on, I'll, I'll be ready, you know. And uh, yeah, I know you're talking about next year to catch Rovers, but for us, it's next five games. Yeah, well, it's, 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 I suppose it's more more of a sense of it's that fresh. It's from zero yeah. to to 100. Obviously, there's still a chance there, um, so I'm not writing that off completely. But like you. You got to say that Derry are starting to become that force now. I remember when you you were at Shamrock Rovers and Dundalk were the team there yeah. to, to beat at the time. The cup final kind of was a bit of a, that change. Yeah. Maybe it hasn't happened this season, but do you think potentially now adding a few bodies to what you already have there, trying to keep the bulk of a of a really strong squad there. Maybe some young lads coming through. Obviously, there's a lot of Ryan Graydon as well. I think yeah. he's a bit of a loss for you guys as well. So I mean, just adding a couple of bodies there, I think you could be right there, up in, or in the running next season. Yeah, no, I think you're right, especially. What you're saying about the Dock and Row was like, I felt that when I was at the club, I could see us coming, you know. And then obviously now I'm with um, Derry, and like, we're doing really well, you know what I mean? We're looking forward to every game. Um, yeah, I don't know, I think maybe, I'm not sure if teams are fearful of us, but we're going in very confident to every game, you know. We're looking to win every game. And that, that can only be good for, especially being a player, being part of the team, you know. I think about anything else other than three points and going scoring goals, you know. Yeah. Just lastly, uh, Brandon, on the, the season itself, in your opinion, what would be a good end to the season without putting too much pressure on yourself? Good end to us is win our next five games. That can that's all you can ask for yourself, you know. It's uh, once we do our job and win every game then sure we can't look back and, and be um, be annoyed with anything, you know. Yeah, no regrets. No, that's it. All right, well listen Brandon, thanks very much for your time. Enjoy FIFA and uh, enjoy the rest of the season. Best of luck of yeah, course. Thanks very much, yeah.